Hey guys, welcome to Project Metal Music's YouTube channel with your host El Young and we are here again to do another top three songs of and this time I'm going to be um, taking a look at uh, Alice, Sweet Alice and their album Viola Orga uh, Organista the Macabre Carnival and uh, yeah uh, this is an absolutely brilliant album, brilliant album, and uh, yeah, uh, this is an 11 track album, and the songs are on the album are uh, Daredevil, Strange Things, Viola Gan uh, Gan uh, Organista, and Other Impossible Dreams, uh, Little Miss Know It All, Osseus, uh, Masochist, Floodwaters, uh, the Hostage, uh, Wednesday's Child, Sucker and Smile. Now I've picked uh, top three songs, uh, I've picked uh, my top three songs and they are Strange Things, Little uh, Little Miss Know It All and um, Floodwaters. So uh, the first one, Strange Things, you know I like this one um, because of the guitars that run throughout the um, throughout the song, um, it's got some cool. They've got some cool guitar solos on this. Uh, the drums and the bass are superb on this. They are tremendous on this one. Um, uh, the singer uh, is brilliant. Uh, she she is brilliant uh, throughout this album. Um, she's put a lot of heart and soul. In every track on this and when I was listening to this track and I was like I was like thinking is that a theremin I can hear um, can I if anybody let if everybody knows uh, whether it be from the band or the know if you heard the song can I hear a theremin on there um, so yeah brilliant track um, so the next one is uh, Little Miss Know It All. Now I like this one is because of the, the um, because of the drums and the bass on this. They are absolutely superb, superb on it. Um, and and really they it, they do really drive the song along. Um, also the guitars are good. The everything about the song, everything about the, uh, the guitars and everything. Instrument wise, are is absolutely brilliant. Uh, again, the singer is absolutely brilliant on this. Like throughout, the, like keeps in throughout the um, throughout the uh, throughout the album. Now, the next one, the final one uh, I've chosen is Floodwaters. Now, I love this song, just for the bass line, just for the bass. As it, as the bass actually takes more of a front uh more of a lead on this one yeah uh, on the song and yeah it's it's yeah i love love it when the bass um it takes more of a forefront on the song um and it's absolutely brilliant um and then it's like cu uh, couple that with like the the drums on this it is the song is makes it does make the song absolutely uh, more powerful. Um, so this uh, the what makes it even better. Uh, what this is one of the reasons why I totally love this song is, is I love the singer on this one. It, it she puts in a lot of a lot of heart and soul in this one on uh, there in the, into this into this and yeah and then couple that with like the um with the guitars on this uh they are absolutely brilliant and, oh, brilliant absolutely brilliant as they uh, as the guitars actually uh, the guitarist actually makes the guitar so on this uh, track and overall over and overall the song is absolutely amazing so i would highly highly recommend you, you to listen to the uh, to fruit waters and it's out it's a must it is a must to listen to uh, fruit waters 
Uh, so yeah, those are my top three songs, and I will put all the links into the description below. So guys, go check them out. I highly recommend, highly recommend uh, Alice Sweet Alice and their album um, Viola Organista, uh, the Macabre Carnival. So guys, go check them out. So until next time, catch you all later.